Hello, hello. Welcome to my channel. My name is Jani. This is a cross stitch channel and I am a Mexican stitcher. Uh, I love to make videos about my projects and fabrics and materials, flosses, uh, different topics related to cross stitch. And sometimes I record videos um, where I stitch, you know, the, the stitch with me videos. And sometimes like uh, today I am adding um, beads to my project so yeah let's let's beat <laughs> together um, I'm finishing this lovely uh, Mirabilia design it's called uh, Twisted Mermaids and they are so gorgeous <laughs> I, I use um, a complete um, conversion of the colors and all the materials actually I use um, rayon flosses for for all the the color of the of the mermaids I use CXC for the skin where I did a conversion of the color of, of the skin of my of my mermaids and I, I didn't use any metallic because I I think that the the rayon flosses were you know shiny and <laughs> pretty enough to 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 serve as a a metallic thread too <laughs> so yeah i just need to finish um putting the the beads in this uh tail of the of the mermaid and because i i changed the colors uh to rayon and the the brand that i'm using is uh iris or iris <laughs> um, they don't have you know all the the colors or the the equivalent to the MC so I change a lot of, of my colors um, you know in order to <laughs> to have all the, the flosses in rayon so my conversion is different from the original design and I decided to to use uh, different beads uh, or different uh, colors of the beads so yeah, <laughs> I was uh, just um, recording a video in in, in Spanish, um, you know, saying that I, I really enjoyed um, making conversion of, of my projects for for different reasons. Um, you know, the the creative part of me loves to to play with the the possibilities of of changing um, a project and make it uh, my own uh, but it's also um, it's also because of economic reasons <laughs> because um, the 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 materials are are really uh, expensive um, you know DMC is expensive um, and and many of, of the the you know linens are expensive uh, and I'm sorry for the noise in the street. <laughs> yeah, I, I was uh, talking about them. I, I like to, to find, you know, different materials for economical reasons. Um, it's uh, cheaper to, to get my, my, my materials, you know, locally. And it's faster, it's cheaper, and I really enjoy playing with with different options. You know, my I like to to be creative and unique in that way. <laughs> and I I also very impatient, impatient. So yeah, sometimes you know it's really expensive. For example, to have to wait for for some um, meal heels. Um, I'm paying the the cost of the chipping and have to wait three to four weeks to to my beads to arrive. So I prefer to to get um, local beads, um, and they look really pretty. <laughs> well, I like them. I don't know if they are, you know, really pretty. <laughs> But I really like them. Yeah, it's mm, 
sometimes it's um, it's it's according to to what we want to stitch. You know, sometimes you you see a, a project and you you have the need to make it uh, just like the pictures that you are seeing. You know, like the original design, because that's the way you like to to you like that design in particular. So sometimes it's not that you don't want to be creative, but it's it's more like you like the 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 design as it is. You know, as the artist um, create that design. So in that case, yeah, you 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 will have to wait for the original materials and you know using the the colors that are called in in the in the project but sometimes you also have that uh, freedom of playing with with different possibilities <laughs> and that's okay too at least for me i really enjoy having that that chance to personalize my projects and I know it's not for everyone um, yeah <laughs> but that's okay I like to, to say that at, at the end of the day is your project and you are the one who's who, who, who are supposed to be happy with, with it so enjoy <laughs> If you want to to stitch, you know, with with all the materials and the colors are the the ones that you really like it, go for it. That's okay. Um, I am adding, talking about personalizations, <laughs> because this tail it's so beautiful. You know, they look like um, ocean waves. They look so pretty and this one it's more subtle <laughs> so I'm adding this uh, beading uh, you know border with beads which originally uh, are not there to give a little more you know punch <laughs> but we'll see we'll see I am just following the 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 outline of the of the tail and adding um, the, the beads because in the original uh, design it only have beads here in this part but I'm adding all this bit here and I will add the beads also here so we'll see and this color of, of beads uh, it's like an old gold you know like um, yeah, like like uh, rustic gold. <laughs> I I thought that they might look good with with my olive greens, but we'll see. We'll see. I can uh, add a different color here of beads. Yeah, perhaps a more uh, a more greenish uh, beads here. We'll see. We'll see. We are just playing with possibilities, and the new the new release of Mirabilia uh, was a show show uh, yesterday, and I really like it. She looks uh, very much like uh, Eliana, um, not in the design in general, but the the kind of dress that it shows you know these these robes or capes or I don't know what they are but um, yeah and she's she looks like um, her little sister you know Eliana's little sister very pretty so and I stitch talking about personalization <laughs> I stitch um, Eliana as a Katrina, <laughs> you know, a total personalization. Uh, but I guess that if I'm going to stitch this new design, it's called uh, Blossom, I will stitch it as it is <laughs> without uh, changing the, the, 
the colors of of uh, you know the colors or or the design as I did in in Katrina, which which was a, a completely conversion, and I love it. But <laughs> we'll see, we'll see. So I'm liking this uh, trail of beads so far. I mean, it's not as beautiful as this one, but <laughs> yeah, this this is more a a shy uh, tail, you know. She she's a a a, a, a little shy mermaid, <laughs> I guess. <laughs> but yeah, she looks pretty. She looks pretty. So. Let me uh, keep adding beads, and I remember in one of my mermaids, um, it was what it was um, waiting for ships. Uh, I I stitched that project in an Aida fourteen, and I added like a, a full uh, trail of, of um, crystals, like bicons, uh, you know, Swarovski bicons, but it, it wasn't, um, they were not uh, Swarovski. They were like, uh, you know, normal <laughs> crystal um, bicons, really pretty. And yeah, and I was thinking maybe I can add, you know, some shine here but I don't know. I will see. I will see. Perhaps here, you know, in the in this part, I can add it, uh, a large crystal here, here, and here. Yeah, I I can see that. Well, <laughs> you will see in my next video. I guess I I will uh, show the finish the finish uh, project and um, I don't have a frame for this project yet uh, so yeah probably will be um, uh, just a, a, f a finish not a fully finish <laughs> and I really like to to frame my my pieces once I finish them because after that, I, you know, I, I, I lost interest <laughs> in them <laughs> and I start with, with a new project. So, yeah, I like to, to frame my pieces once I finish them. But for, for this, this project, I don't have uh, a frame. So I will have to wait anyway. So, yeah, this is my... Uh, my rocky, <laughs> shaky, uh, bid with me. I will find some crystals to add to this tail. And, and also I'm going to, to be preparing my, my project for my birthday. My birthday is on February 21st. Yeah. <laughs> and and I just make a boo-boo here <laughs> and I love to 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 have my my birthday um you know with with a new a new start and also inviting you to to start something to celebrate my birthday so I have a, a couple of of years having this tradition so yeah, I have to, to change the, the thread. I had a little mishap, <laughs> but I fixed it, I think. Um, I'm using this um, nylon, uh, Wonder Invisible Thread, uh, nylon, 100% nylon, 0 0.004, which is really, really thin. <laughs> and I really like to work with this because um, yeah, it's very invisible. So <laughs> I I I like to 
to to know no no see the 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 threat of the beating <laughs> you can of course use uh, dmc or um, other type of, of uh, flaws or thread to to attach your beads but I really like this um, nylon because it's very invisible and it's a little tricky to to work with but yeah I think it it worked the the extra the extra work <laughs> for the the final look but you can use whatever you you have um and yeah i'm adding all these beatings to to my my well my mermaid's tail um probably will add you know the the crystals at the end but i don't know perhaps and uh, yeah i was um telling you about my my birthday i love to start a new project on my birthday and you know to make a, a celebration so if you want to to start a new project you are welcome to join the celebration uh, I have a, a hashtag in Spanish is um, because Jani let me do it <laughs> or give me permission so in Spanish is a uh, hashtag Jani medio permiso <laughs> So yeah, you can blame me for starting you a new project because sometimes we we feel this guilt, no? Of oh, I have a lot of of whips or I have a lot of projects and I can no um you know, start a new one, but if I I give you the permission, you can do it. <laughs> In that case, won't be your fault would be mine and um, because it's my birthday um, you know that's okay <laughs> it's all part of the game but yeah and I I have been um, starting a few projects so I I don't really know what project to start for my birthday I have a few beautiful uh, you know projects and and charts that I can start but yeah I don't really have one in in particular in particular one in a special one <laughs> I I was uh, seeing the the new releases for the Nashville market and the large uh, sampler from Teresa Good. it's so beautiful oh my god I will have to order that chart and yeah <laughs> and wait a long time to receive it because uh, Teresa um, usually doesn't have that uh, charts on PDF version she, she sells uh, some PDFs but not the the larger ones perhaps this year she she sell those one but also um we have to to wait uh because uh they always give you know to the uh l n s um sometimes for them to to sell the the projects the the charts and after that they the designers you know start selling the 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 charts in pdf or printed but yeah one year i i order some uh, some uh, releases from nashville but they took a long time to arrive to me and once i got it I have to pay a lot of <laughs> taxes for the shipping, you know, the parcel and everything. So, yeah, I'm, <laughs> I don't know what to do. I, I guess I will um, wait to see if they are going to, to release them as PDF. 
and if not I I, I make a I, I got I will get the, the printed pattern but yeah we'll see we'll see I can you know order to the, the new Mirabilia it's really really beautiful blossom so yeah because we know that um, no chart travels alone <laughs> so yeah that's the, ru the rule I didn't make it <laughs> I just need to follow it so yeah <laughs> okay okay um, I hope you can s you can uh, see some of the <laughs> of the bidding that I did I will um, find I will find in my stash some crystals to add here and I will change the color of the beads here to a brighter green so yeah we'll see we'll see yeah almost done almost done so thank you for for beat with me <laughs> uh, in in the next video I will show the the full uh, projects and also some of the projects that I am working on and per perhaps the the new birthday start <laughs> so we'll see thank you for for being here for stitch with me for let me be part of this amazing community um, please subscribe um, click the, the little bell um, if you want to to uh, buy me a cup of coffee I will let the link below so yeah I will see you in my next video bye bye